The Washington, D.C. International at Laurel stars four-year-old American speedster Gunbow, six hand-picked foreign invaders, and four-time Horse of the Year Kelso, giving the U.S. two entries in the mile-and-a-half grass course event. Gunbow gets away well and takes a clear lead. Kelso is for now content to pursue the pace setter. The seven-year-old gelding has finished second in the past three internationals, and many wonder whether it will be Kelso's fate again today. Winner of 26 stakes in compiling the world's money-winning record of more than $1,800,000, Kelso has raced four times against Gunbow this year. They have split even, so this fifth meeting is the big one. The one-two order, which remains the same into the backstretch, now undergoes an abrupt change. Watch Kelso close the gap, the mark of the champion. Coming off the stretch turn, Kelso opens up about two lengths. Jockey Nilo Valenzuela takes him over to the rail. And it is this crossing over in front of Gunbow that his rider Walter Blum is to claim as a foul. Leading by four and a half lengths, Kelso wins in American record time of two minutes, 23 and four-fifths seconds. But Jockey Blum's protest causes a dramatic delay, but soon it's official. Kelso is indeed the $90,000 winner of what turned out to be a match race between the American horses. It is very probably Kelso's last season. The final touch would be to be named Horse of the Year for an unprecedented fifth straight season.